We begin the news at one with this warning from the United States to the Nigerian government, which says that the use of the Super Tucano must comply with international norms as articulated in the United Nations Charter. The warning is coming at a time the Nigerian Air Force is preparing to deploy the fighter jet to the front line in the northwest and north central after the federal government officially designated bandits in the region as terrorists. But Nigerian Air Force says there is nothing to worry about as it assures civilians of their safety ahead of the deployment against bandits. The U.S., while advising Nigeria, said the federal government should not deploy the aircraft in operations that encroach on traditional law enforcement rule, which is under police authority. The press attache, U.S. Embassy Jean Clark, in her statement, said the U.S. government was, however, pleased that the Nigerian Air Force had used the A-29 Super Tucanos successfully against Boko Haram and the Islamic State West African province.